Okay, so this uh, yellow one here on the uh, resource hive is the Italian that's been weak all this year. Um, just discovered a couple of days ago that um, it has European fowl brood uh, called the uh, state inspector. Uh, she came out yesterday, ran the test, and it does in fact have European fowl brood. So there's two different ways I could go about um, taking care of this. Uh, one way would get a veterinarian, get the prescription for the antibiotic, uh, take care of it uh, that way to treat it, uh, which is a fed treatment. It's not injecting, but a, a fed treatment uh, antibiotic. Um, or the other way is I could just replace all the comb, just do a complete comb replacement. Um, and that's actually the option I'm going to do. Uh, with it just being a nuke, I'm just going to replace all this comb with a brand new one. Uh, the bees will just have to start over. I am going to take a couple of uh, brood frames out of a strong hive to put in here to give them a start. Um, I'm going to try one of the better combs, put those in there, and then the rest are going to be empty. And I'm just going to feed it. Uh, I think that's going to be the best option for this uh, with the bee on nuke. If it was a big production hive, I probably would have went the route of getting the antibiotic. Uh, but with it just being a nuke, I'm just going to experiment with just replacing all the comb and then just uh, destroying all the comb that I take out of here. Uh, it, European fowl brood is uh, a brood disease, so that's not something that's attached all over the bees to where they need um, fumed or you know treated really themselves per se. Um, so yeah, I can just do a, um, a comb replacement, take everything out, and then put all new in. So that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to replace this and then um, Hopefully all goes well and that, uh, that helps it. Okay, so... See if we can get some of this on camera here. Uh, not really too much an issue with the capped brood, just mainly the uncapped. Uh, they just don't, not very many of them are reaching the capped brood stage. We'll see how good of a shot we can get down in there of the larvae. What do you think? Okay, so spotted the queen. Okay, got her in a queen, queen clip. Okay, so I got it all cleaned out. Uh, now I'm just going to start putting the uh, new frames in. have a honey frame from another hive a uh, frame of capped brood from another hive another capped brood frame And next to the brood frame, I'm going to try this uh, better comb frame. Let's see if they uh, lay in it or if they just use it for storage. Okay, I'm going to shake these bees down in here from the old frame.
Okay, now I'm going to put the uh, frame feeder in. I have three waxed new frames. Okay. okay. I'll release her back in. There she goes, crawling down in the frame. Okay, got them all changed over. Uh, bees are going to um, or bees are flying around, but they will find their way back here. Uh, I got them all shook off back in. So I'm going to destroy the old frames. I'm not going to take any chance of melting the wax down and using it for anything. Um, throughout the season, I'm going to keep updated on uh, this hive uh, to show you the progression of what's happened. Uh, also, that uh, better comb that's in there, what are they using that for? Um, but on the, the, the main note is going to be to follow the progression of the European fowl brood. The change in all this out actually helped things. Uh, so yeah, subscribe. Um, stay up to date with me on what's going on. And if you uh, have ever had a um, European fowl brood, feel free to leave something in the comments. Let me know how you handled it, how it all worked out for you. All right, thank you. Have a great day.